Jesus Christ, am I tired. <laughs> I am tired, but I must stream. Hello, 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 everybody. Hello, Mr. G. Hello. It is... Yeah, sorry, I ate a Pop-Tart earlier. It is Amnesia Debunker time. I tired too. Yeah, I'm tired. Uh, I haven't realized how tired I'd be after I did my workout today. I haven't realized how tired I'd be. Feet still hurt. I feel that honestly right now after the workout I did earlier. Because it was that kind of workout where it works out your whole body. And my legs got a real fucking workout. My dear lord. My legs are sore. I was doing planks, I was doing like Spider-Man planks and like high knees and mountain climbers and all that nice jazz. Like I was doing a Chloe Ting workout, if you know who that YouTuber is, but I did that and it's, it, yeah, God, my leg muscles. Oof, yeah. Ahoy. Ahoy, poopy snoopy. How are you? How has your day been? But yeah, it was like doing planks and shit i couldn't finish the first video because i was like holy shit please my legs hurt uh i did the warm-up and then i did like half of the first video because it was just really intense on my body good job thank you me and my best friend have decided for now we're going to do uh me and halo have decided for now we're going to just get used to the warm-up video then we're going to add on the do this every day like workout full body workout video and then we should be we should be able to gradually work our way up. But every day at six o'clock for me, six o'clock PM for me, gonna work out and uh we're gonna we're gonna work out basically. Is just the whole idea. Is like every day, six o'clock PM we're gonna work out together. That's a good idea. You don't want to overdo it yet. Technically the uh Technically, the video, we we were just doing, like, you know, the basics of, like, you know, the warm-up, and then you do the body exercise, but, like, the body exercise is t intense. It's three sets of workout. Each are, like, fuck, how long is it? I, I don't know, but you really feel it when you have to start moving your legs and doing mountain climbers and planks and corkscrews and shit, because... Uh, uh, you're immediately like, holy shit, every muscle in my body is being worked out, especially my legs. This is intense. Hello, Serenity! Hello, 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 hello! How are you? How has your day been? Uh, uh, I guess on a fairly... I've been reading the Freddy vs. Jason vs. Ash comic. Wait! What? That's a comic? I didn't even know that was a comic. Holy shit. Damn. <sighs> no, I will not be sleeping. Not at least for two hours. That's my bare minimum with streaming. Yep. Uh, bah, 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 bah. uh on a... Well, yeah, that's right. I probably shouldn't start this immediately, but I'm going to go on a little talk. Because I, I will waste energy and stuff in the game. Been okay? Hope you're doing well after all the Twitter fuckery today. Oh, yeah, that's what I was going to address. For those of you who have seen my Twitter, I'm going to be blunt with all of y'all. I usually do not fuck around with VTuber drama. I keep my nose clean. I stay off that shit. I really don't like being part of the fucking drama sphere. It's not my thing. It particularly pissed me off, though, today. Because, uh, if any of you know the VTuber Kenji, Kenji made a joke... And whether you agree with it or not, I personally, I didn't even laugh at the joke, but I don't think the dude deserved all the racist slurs he got for it. Literally, the dude did a joke uh, over a VTuber concert clip that went viral. There were normal people, I guess what Twitter would call normies, that got a hold of that VTuber's uh, clip. And forgive me if I'm butchering his name. It's like Dakapo, I think, is how that VTuber's name is pronounced. Dakapo's cl concert clip went viral, and there were people harassing him and actually being, you know, dickheads to him. Well, Kenji didn't know. Kenji saw the clip on uh, TikTok and was like, not like the concert clip even, just like a bunch of the movement and stuff. Like people were doing jokes about how the movement's stiff. Kenji caught. Kenji made a short video, 
a short clip and copied it. Didn't say nothing. It was just literally Kenji uh, just doing a whole thing where, like, he danced around and then he put his arms up in the air when the crowd cheered. And uh, he basically pissed off the community of that VTuber. And it caused a whole back and forth fight between the communities. And, you know, I'm going to be honest, I feel like it's a big thing with culture difference and humor. I feel like there's a big difference in culture humor there, which probably sounds weird, but I have no other way to put it besides, like, there's there's humor that you find in the West, and then there's humor you find in the East. And I'm going to tell you all this right now from what I've seen. Roasting. Roasting each other is very normal in the black community. Roasting each other is very normal in Western uh, comedy and communities. In the East, it's not really the same. And I think that's the biggest thing of what's caused this is the culture clash difference when it comes to humor and jokes and stuff. But they got pissed off at Kenji. But there was a group of people who would encourage or approve of people throwing slurs at Kenji. Man got called slurs. Like, I can't make this shit up. Like, I have a whole video and all that I made because I got pissed off the whole situation today. And I know, again, I'm sorry, I don't usually talk about, like, VTuber drama, but it particularly messes with me because, you guys know, I am a POC VTuber. I am a POC VTuber. I am, like, multiracial. I have a black father and a white mother. And racism is something I do deal with. And I hate seeing people sit there and be like, Kenji made a post that said, it feels like I'm in a COD lobby getting called all these slurs. And I literally saw people in the quote retreat saying he deserved to be called slurs. I'm like, ain't no fucking way you're going to sit here and say that's right. Ain't no fucking way. It's bullshit. It is absolute fucking bullshittery. You cannot justify calling somebody a slur. You can't justify racism. There is nothing. You immediately lose the argument if you think that's how it's going to work. Hi, Nanako. Uh, you're hearing me go on a rant. <laughs> You're hearing me go on a bit of a rant. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I was pissed off about it. So pissed off. Again, I'm a POC VTuber. I'm not saying that Kinsey's joke was okay. Again, I, I, my whole opinion is if it's for you, it's for you. If it's not, it's not. Personally, I do like Kinsey's humor. Again, this one I didn't really care for. It just wasn't clicking with me anyways. Like, it just wasn't there. But like... You do not try to do that and then start throwing slurs and racism. Man got called a charcoal monkey. What the fuck is with that? How are you going to throw that at somebody? That's so fucked up. That is so fucked up. You can't justify that shit to me. There is not a, a way you can justify that shit to me. Not even a little bit. That's what this whole thing was? Yes. Yes. Like, I have the video I made right here. Look at this shit. This shit is wacky. Wait, is the audio on? Because I have to make sure the audio is on. Tell me if you guys can hear it. Did you hear it? People are fucked. Yeah, that's putting it lightly. Honestly, don't know how people can live with themselves like that. Racists don't care. I'm going to give y'all a bit... Yeah, it's a bit loud, though. Here, I'll turn it down. Racists don't care, though. I'm going to tell y'all right now, straight from my mouth, racists don't care. They never care. That better? Uh, such a silly joke and start throwing slurs. I'm not going to be mad at anybody who had legit concerns. Still loud? Okay, turn it down more. I'm not going to be mad at anybody who had legit concerns because that other VTuber was being harassed. And that trend was pretty much dunking on that VTuber. Kenji didn't know, but I completely understand they have actual concerns. And I've seen actual valid concerns they brought up. It is the motherfuckers encouraging the racism that pisses me off. And then the VTuber community, everybody went fucking silent except for black VTubers. Everybody except for black and POC VTubers went fucking silent. And I'm sitting there like, ain't no way you motherfuckers just went quiet on us like that. Are too icky for me to deal with. Yeah. Again, I'm not saying everything Kenji does is okay. There have been moments, and I'll definitely say this during that whole situation, Kenji did bring up one thing, and he was like, oh, publicity is good, whether it's negative or positive. 
I'm going to be honest, as much as I love Kenzie's content, I'm not going to defend that one. That man should not have brought that up. We all know the whole thing of any publicity is good publicity, but that is not how everybody works in the sphere. And that one, that one I'm going to give him a, a mark off for. That one's not right. The rest of that bullshit, though, there was no need for that. Uh, okay, how about this? Is this good now? How's that? Loud or is it good now? I knew people were making fun of him. I, I didn't understand that either. Again, pretty good. Better? Okay. This was the whole thing I did. And I'll pause so y'all can see the fucking screenshots I took. It was meant to be both funny and me being pissed off is what this was. This is what he made. This is the clip Kenji made. So you had that and then motherfucker got called that. You see this shit? This person wasn't even a fan of Daco, uh, of Dakapo, the other VTuber. Literally was just being racist. And then you had this one, which is just them saying the ugliest, meanest shit. And you're all like, that's one person. There's more. I have more screenshots. There's more screenshots. Listen, look at this one. Feels like I'm out here in a COD lobby with the way they throw in slurs at me. And somebody's like, it's worth throwing poop at other people and thinking that other people will throw flowers back at you. I'm like... That is not the fucking point of that, my dude. If you're, it's one thing if Kenji was being called a dumbass or an idiot. That's one thing. These motherfuckers are calling him slurs, though. There's a difference. You do not, th these two things do not fucking equate. These two things would not fucking equate. They wouldn't equate to you if somebody was throwing a slur at you. It does not equate. Oh my God, there's also. Uh, damn, that's disgusting. Yeah, that shit's... Mm -mm. To be honest, Kenji could have done anything and it would never justify using slurs. There is no justification for using slurs. There is no justification for uh, racism. There will never be. No matter what you say to me, there will never be any justification for it. That is not how you handle this shit. We are grown-ass fucking adults. We can say this shit. We can say this shit and not be horrible. If you don't like his content and you don't support him and you dislike him, fine. But you do not use racism. You do not use slurs. That shit is bullshit. You cannot justify that shit to me. You immediately lose whatever standing you have the second you do that. And then there's... I still have more screenshots, guys. We're not even halfway through this shit. And then there were people pissed off at him again. Because I thought it was crazy how... Kenji had liked the person who had made the uh, dude's model. And people are like, oh, you're making fun of his model and shit. But I'm like, it's not the model he's talking about. He found the rigging funny because the truth is we all have stiff, we all have wonky, a little bit stiff rigging as VTubers. And like, again, even for me, look at me. I'm a little wonky with my movement and that's okay. You can giggle about it. It's not the end of the world. The dude, and again, again, Kenji was not insulting the man. He was saying like the rigging's funny and that's, that's it. There's nothing wrong with that. They probably just want an excuse. Probably. I have no fucking clue, but this shit is weird to me. And this! Okay, thank you for hurting Daka's fans, and I pray that your job duties worsen from your own actions. This one was just adding more fuel to the fire with the COD uh, tweet Kenji made. This one. And then you have this one. Like, what is this? What is this? What the fuck is this? What is this shit? What do you mean? And then there's this one where this person's just like deserved. It's crazy shit to me. And then again, more people being like, Kenji graduation? Oh, this one was really agitating to me. This person really tried to justify it. You can do it, but everyone can't do it with you? Wow, interesting. Motherfucker, Kenji did not throw slurs at anybody. What do you mean? It's, it's, people can't do it with you. People, he never threw a slur. He didn't even talk during the whole video, and y'all are just like, we can do it, because you poked fun at our VTuber. Dude, 
there is nothing there was no slurs used even if oh god it's just horrible even if kimji had used like slurs you don't use slurs back you that's when you would actually have a reason to just be like cancel this vtuber cancel but they're trying to cancel him over something that i feel like is a cultural difference in humor in this again you cannot equate this poking fun at a vtuber's rigging does not equate to justifying slurs and racism again it's just crazy shit this one was crazy too this one's like do you have a right to fuss you do this to other people first and what you're getting now is what he's been getting uh and now you come out and talk like other people don't care about your feelings isn't it it's not cute at all and i'm like this is it's not the same thing it's one thing if he was complaining about model movements or how people viewed his model and how it worked it's another when he's complaining about fucking racism oh it's completely different it's so different Kenji getting mad shit. Mad shit. And again, I, I do think there are moments that Kenji could have handled better. I'm not going to give that man just a free pass on the when he was talking about publicity and marketing. Man does not get a pass on that one. There was m better ways to address that, and he did not have social tact in that situation. Did not have social tact. But he did not deserve to be called slurs or anything. If you disagreed with him, and you disliked him, and you don't support his content and what he did... Completely valid. Fair, bestie. Go live your best life. If you do not like him, 100%. And you are free to say that however you please. But you do not encourage racism. And you do not use slurs. This shit will never be justified. And this one, too, where the people... This one really irked me. Because everybody makes jokes about the submarine shit that happened with the rich billionaires that died. To which they're going to say, one of those dudes wasn't even a billionaire. He was the son of a billionaire. So technically, it wasn't even his money. It was his daddy's money. And he was just 19 years old, and he died in that fucking thing. But we can all make jokes about him and, his, and the rest of them dying. But the second we poke fun at a VTuber's rigging, it's wrong. Like, literally, this person's like, those weren't regular people. I'm like, they were still people why can you joke about people dying but then we can't poke fun at just stiff rigging what is the point of that what do you mean and then saying these two things don't equate motherfucker we're talking about how vtubers pick and choose what to make jokes about and what's okay to make jokes about and how it's not fair uh these double standards there's a difference there is a major difference Huh. Oh, and yeah, and here's the end, because I've got one last thing to say to everybody. This is the last thing I want everybody to know from me. I can't stand it here so much. I really can't. I love VTubing, but God, do I want to turn around and choke the living hell out of half over half of the VTuber community. I love VTubing. I love it. It's a wonderful medium. It's fun for streaming. But God, if I don't want to choke the life out of some people. It is time to look at threads again. You know what's funny? I never advertised it on Twitter because I just didn't feel like it was needing to be like advertised or anything. But like, I have a threads account. I do have a threads account. Yeah, it's probably a good thing I rarely use Twitter after seeing this. Yeah, I really only mostly use it for, like, you know, assets, raffles, all that nice jazz, posting when I'm live. Honestly, if you scroll through my Twitter, you'll see that with the occasional post about art or something. Or something good happening or anything else. Like, if you look through my Twitter, I tell you this honestly, I keep it mostly squeaky clean. There's very little I get involved on Twitter because I know how Twitter is. But this is different for me because as a POC person, as somebody who is multiracial and again, black father, white mother, I, 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 have, I, I just can't fucking sit by with that shit. It hits a special nerve for me. VTuber community, am I right? Fucking right. The VTuber community, Jesus Christ. I barely use Twitter. I should make a Threads account. I made a Threads account. 
it's not bad. I mean, I haven't really gotten any traction on it or anything, but it's like, it's not bad. It's kind of funny just scrolling through there and you just see random stuff. It's not even like Twitter random stuff. Honestly, I go, I scroll th through there and mostly I see Jacksepticeye and like uh, Ethan Nestor post more than anything. It's kind of funny. I was going to wait it out and see if the hype would die down. <laughs> it's not really all that special, but it's like a cleaner version of Twitter for right now. It's like clean. Downright a little bit wholesome, I'd almost say. I'd rather have Instagram. Instagram's also not bad. If you're going to use Twitter, my God, please limit yourself. And once again, I rarely get involved in VTuber drama. I hate drama like the plague. This just hit me on a special nerve, though. Unfortunately, it's such a big community. There's going to be lots of different subgroups, and many are going to be crap. This is true. Entirely true. Ever since 2020, everyone who's a weave in different cultures or, ba or basically anything, it's basically hell on earth. It's hell on earth on Twitter, regardless of whether you're a weave or not. It's hell on earth on Twitter. Sounds like my kind of place. It's honestly not bad on threads right now. It's honestly pretty tame. Nothing bad, really. I don't know how long it's going to last, but, like, it's not bad on there. I will say this, though. I have noticed one thing. The only people who really get traction on their uh, stuff on, on their post on threads have to be verified. So if you do want any traction on your post, I suspect you probably have to be verified. Because if you aren't already having a big following on there and you want a big following on threads, you probably should get verification for that. So it did take one thing from Twitter, but it's not like the worst like thing in the world, I guess. It could be much worse. At least it's clean. At least when I scroll through threads, it's not like I'm losing brain cells or my life is fleeting from me because I'm just seeing horrible shit as I doom scroll. I blame the Tumblr uh, immigration. I don't think it's all Tumblr. Actually, no. Tumblr did sh create a big shift. I'm going to give that to... I feel like a lot of it's also how Twitter is built. I feel like part of it can be how people move from Tumblr over to Twitter, but I also feel like it can be a lot of how Twitter is just built. With squeaky clean people went to Twitter really makes you think. It does make you think, and I feel like that does have some merit to an extent, but I feel like a lot of it is still also how Twitter is built. It is the kind of environment it cultivates because of how it's built and how it's framed. There weren't a bunch of uh, nutters on Tumblr, though. Oh, Serenity, I don't think you know. There were some crazy-ass people on Tumblr still. It wasn't always, like, as crazy as Twitter, mind you. But there were crazy people on there. Don't, don't, don't let nobody tell you different. Oh, okay, also, I should get into this, because we're, like, nearly 30 minutes into this stream, and I've just been ranting. But, yeah. That's my big... Uh, elephant in the room I wanted to address. She doesn't know. She doesn't know. Serenity. There was some crazy shit on Tumblr. Just let me live under my rock. You know what? Fair and valid. Fair and valid. I, I respect it. Fair and valid. I respect it. I do not blame you. Fair and valid. I, it com I completely understand. But yeah, I just wanted to address the big elephant in the room because I do know I made a big post about it because it did irk me a special kind of way. And thank you guys for listening and letting me like talk about it. I felt like it was a very serious topic that couldn't just be ignored. Oh yeah, I probably should put my headset all the way on because I actually have to listen for this bitch in the game. Props for speaking up. Thank you. I, again, I don't usually speak on VTuber drama and shit because I don't like to be part of drama. I hate it. I very much hate it. But I can't stand just ignoring it either. Thanks for explaining the situation. I have no problem explaining it. I tried to explain it the best I can, and I do want to understand both sides and all sides as much as possible, except for the racist sides. I don't want to know what their sides are or understand them. They're automatically wrong in my mind, and I don't give a shit what anybody has to say about that. But, uh, for the rest of everything, though, I do want to, like, understand everybody's side as much as Oh! Oh! Please! No! I just got in here! Oh! 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 Move! 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 That was bull-
bullshit. Oh, I went the wrong way anyways. That was the prison. I need to go to the arsenal. Okay. Du the duality of VTubing. <laughs> you can't justify racism. There is no way to justify it. Any kind of racism, you can't justify it. You lose whatever argument you had the second you do that. The second you resort to things like racism, homophobia, transphobia, misogyny, and all that shit, you lose your, your argument. You lose... You fucking lose. Mm, this fucking thing crawling in the walls. Uh, it's just crazy shit. I just want the VTuber community to just speak up about shit that is honestly bad and stop going quiet when unfair shit happens oh i'm having a rough night tonight you know i'm having a rough night tonight you know i'm probably gonna die a horrible death i'm probably gonna die a horrible death i'm probably gonna die a horrible death <laughs> Bleeding. Yeah, I am. Enemy girl. Is he walking around? Or is he just growling? I think he's just growling. No, he might not be growling for too long. I just want to watch funny, cute, sweet, living anime girls. Why do people have to ruin it by being shitty? Because people, for some reason, by human nature, feel the need to be dickheads. Uh, notes. Codes. Arsenal code 9807. 9-8-0-7. Locked. Oh, have mercy on me. <gasps> Gasoline. Wait, what? What do I? Okay, that. Be nice to me, please. Be nice. to me please tripwire haha I see you you're not slick uh. oh my god uh, my lord my lord so dark 
It's so dark. It's so dark. Gasoline. I love, but also, it's so dark. Don't, please. Oh, I'm bleeding, and he's walking around. I'm bleeding, and he's walking around. Go away, please. I'll give you a Sinadaki Marble. Go away. Oh. 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 Make promises of a body pillow and you'll be safe, guys. <laughs> I am now obligated to make a Cinna body pillow. <sighs> oh my god. I am now obligated to give the monster a Cinna body pillow. Uh, okay, I need you guys to throw out ideas. I need you to throw out ideas. What kind of pose should I have her have? Do we need to go... Do we need to go straight up smug and snarky and assholery? <laughs> I'm probably like a smug asshole. Like, laying... Like, Senna just laying down on the pillow. And she, like, has, the, of course, the knees slightly bent. Maybe an arm or something laying over her stomach or something, or chest. And then, like... Just the other hand is her holding her hand up with a middle finger to whoever, to the first, to the person looking at the donkey Maru, because I feel like that fits me perfectly. All smug and smiley, just like fuck you. And on the other end could be Kursana doing the exact same thing. Well, not the exact same thing, but you know, flipping you off still. I want one heavy breathing. Calm down. I can't actually make us a donkey Maru, guys. I wish I could. But I can't. Nice lol. I wish I could, but I can't. Maybe one day. Maybe one day. If Senna becomes big VTuber, maybe one day. Uh, but that takes luck and a lot of work. That takes a lot of luck and work to become a, a big VTuber. <laughs> so I was about to say how the sketch of my 90s style picture was unfortunately delayed, only for her to send it to me before I could type it out. Oh, that's good. I'm glad she was able to send it to you. Sorry it got delayed, but I'm glad she was still able to send it to you so quickly. Those all sound like winners. Honest to God, I would have so much fun if I could make a Senadaki Maru. I would have so much fun. It wouldn't even, like... I'm not, like, a very sexual person, I admit. I'm not really going to probably go for, like, a whole sexual NSFW Daki Maru. But I would go for one where, like, smug Senna flipping you off and then curse Senna's doing the exact same thing on the other side. I'm hungry and you look like a snack. <gasps> No, don't eat me. Don't eat me. I'm too precious. I'm too precious to snack upon. Uh. <laughs> uh, hello, our dear favorite space fish. You walked in at such an interesting time. Teasing, teasing is better anyways. Well, now we know more about Mr. G. <laughs> now we know more about what Mr. G's into. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just had to give you shit, man. It's funny. Mm. <sighs> I walked in after work. <laughs> oh. Oh! Oh, I think I see what the point of this area is. And while I'd love to enjoy it more, I really should go bandage my ass up after it got hurt tremendously running for my life. Oh, hey. 
There's nothing on the back of this. Waste of time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's that? That's a bottle. Also, there's something to be known about this game that I didn't know about earlier before. That's really fucking interesting. Because I had a friend who wanted me to show her what the game was like. So I showed a friend, and I have a separate save I showed her on. I didn't show her on this save. But I created a separate save, and I showed her what this game is like. And, uh, basically, uh, uh, but, 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 what I learned is the items in this game are RNG. Not, like, uh, there are, of course, events and shit that happen. Uh, normally that will always happen but like I noticed the items in the game are RNG like uh, like for instance uh, b -b 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 the gasoline won't always be in the same place there will be like you know how I found gasoline in here it was not in here on the second say on the second game when I was showing my friend which shows to show that the items will always be in different areas and they will always be different in their randomized snack <laughs> not a coke clip in the snack we saved this guess my god jokes on you I'm into that shit see I called you out on it and you really are into that shit ho ho Oh wait, no, wrong way. I need to put this in there. Yeah, I need these. Because I hurt myself. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Hi, Sina. Hi, Corey! Hi! My favorite ice princess is here. Hi, 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 hi! Welcome, Cory. We are playing Amnesia the Bunker tonight. Amnesia the Bunker. I nearly got myself killed already. <laughs> My favorite cute and creepy cinnamon roll. My favorite silly ice princess. Oh my god. Uh, I'm glad you got here, Cory. You got here for the fun stuff. Noise, yeah. This game is pretty fun, Cory. This one's based off sound mechanics a whole lot. Is it scary? It's pretty good. Uh, of course, like. You know, it has the basic things of, like, you know, violence and all that jazz. Oh, my God. There's so much fuel in this area. It has resource management, though, which is really cool, in my opinion. Which I've never seen in an Amnesia game to this extent. So, you have resource management and stuff, which is really cool. Like, uh, gasoline stuff to keep the lights on. A timer to tell you how long you have for things. It's super cool. Honest to God, I'd recommend it. It's fun. It's pretty fun. Ooh, interesting. Yeah, it's pretty fun, honestly. I recommend it because it has the... If you like the original Amnesia, honestly, you'll like this. If you like the original Amnesia, you'll like this. Because it's like original Amnesia with a twist on it. Which I find very respectable. Oh, it's locked. Well, that fucking sucks. That's pretty neat. It was pouring it. It was pouring... Honest to God, it's been pouring the past couple days in my area, though that's probably not too bad considering I think we nearly had a drought where I'm at. Nearly. Or maybe it was like a small drought. I have no clue. I just know it hadn't rained a whole lot when the summer started. I admit, I don't know much about these games. These games are pretty cool, honest. Mm, I almost set off a trap. Here I am talking about being careful, and I am being the exact opposite of careful. God, do not get yourself killed, Sana. Do not. You rat bastards. Everywhere I go, you around here causing shit problems. Um. Ooh. Can he knock that down? That's wooden, so I'm going to assume that he can knock that down. Easy free shower, just bring the shampoo. <laughs> Ooh, the 
this is smart. Wait a minute. That's gonna make a noise though. I need to know exactly where the fuck I'm gonna run. I need to know exactly where I'm gonna run. Let's talk about this, please don't. I fucked up! Yo girl fucked up! I fucked up! I sat here the whole time talking about that strip wire, and I fucked up. Your girl fucked up bad. I fucked up bad. I fucked up bad. I fucked up bad. I fucked up bad. <laughs> I fucked up bad. I fucking hate this. No, I have no more healing. Unfortunately, I was stuck at work. Ah, uh, that sucks. I'm having trouble figuring out a pose for this drawing, so I'm gonna put all my focus here so I can grab clips. Aw, Nanako, you don't have to do that. I always appreciate the eclipse stuff from you. I want you to know to never feel obligated to. Wait, why did I do that? I didn't have to put any fucking gasoline there. I'm stupid. <sighs> I smelled rain in the air, so I'm hoping it rained. I want a clip! Nanako, you're an absolute joy! Thank you, I always appreciate the support and the help. Especially since, like, literally, if it wasn't for you clipping right now, I'd probably be behind on clips a little bit. I'm honestly, a lot of my clips I, I do have are from you at this point, Nanako, and it makes it so much easier for me to do shorts every day. I wake up, and I'm just like, ooh, okay, what... Well, let's just open up Twitch and look in the clip section, because Nanako got everything covered. I'm still gushing about how cute your new character is. I love my new model. I'm so excited for when I'm able to show her off on stream moving. I'm so excited. I'm excited to see uh, to see uh, the art Stark uh, is going to get done, too, that I commissioned her for, because I love it, and I'm going to use it for my schedule. And I'm so excited for it. I'm so excited. You guys have no idea how badly I want to whip out everything I've, like, worked on and just shove it in your face. Like, look! Look at how hard I've worked! I'm so proud of this! I have an idea with something. I have an idea with something. It's either going to be super stupid, or it's going to be fucking genius. I have an idea with something, though. Because something just occurred to me. Is either gonna be really stupid or incredibly fucking smart. You see what I got going on here? You see what this big brain move is that I'm thinking of here? Okay. Of course, you know, I'm glad it makes it a little easier for you. I really do appreciate it, Nanako. It really does help make it easier. I could literally pull clips, like, easily as soon as I wake up in the morning. And I'm able to edit them immediately. He's right above me. Coming? I don't think he's coming. Ah. I told others, all right, gamers, I gotta go to my internship. <laughs> I love how that's how you respond to. S I love that that's what you tell Stark and Claire. We made a joke about it, and it's just become the joke immediately. What's up, gamers? I gotta go to my internship. Oh, God. I'm going to get some cute pics of her done once we see her. Aww. Well, I'm excited for you guys to see her whenever I can show her off to you guys. Because, like, again, I worked hard on her. That was... It took me three months to make that model. So I'm so excited. And I got, like, an update of seeing her blink and everything, which is so nice to see. 
These little shits are falling the fuck out of me. Can I get away with this? Probably not. Yeah, that's right. Back up, motherfuckers. And I'll take that. Maybe I fucked up. Maybe I fucked up and fucked around a little too much. Oh, no. Oh, please, no. Let's talk about this. Please. Oh, God. Distorted human face. Distorted human face. Oh, God. Lord, have mercy. He's not going that way, is he? Is he going that way? Holy shit! He's pissed. He is pissed. God, he is pissed. He is so angry. <laughs> oh my god, he is so angry. Daddy isn't happy. Daddy is very unhappy tonight. <sighs> it's like I need my own name tag to say I'm the intern. Nanako, I'm going to give you that nickname on the uh, on the Discord server. I think your nickname on the Discord server. You're gonna get the nickname, uh, you're gonna get the nickname, the intern. You're gonna get the nickname, the intern. And also let me catch up on chat real quick. Let me, oh, god damn, yeah. <sighs> I hope you forever know I'm happy to lend a helping hand. It's one of my favorite things to do to help others, like, aww. Nanako, If I ever make it as a big VTuber, Nanako, I'm gonna literally hire you as 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 my honorary clipper. This person gets my clips, so I hired them. Respect them. But I'm, uh, I'm gonna get some cute pics of her done once we can see her. Yeah, I'm excited for when she gets finished. I'm excited for you guys to see the overlays and everything. They're so cute. I can't draw worth a damn, but I can at least commission all. Know that you are not obligated to commis commission any art from me or anything. Know that if you, uh, I just want, if you guys do want to get any art of me or anything or commission somebody for art of me, like, I want you all to know, like, never feel obligated and it will always be appreciated both from you and the artist. And I will happily 100% give credit to you for commissioning and the artist for, of course, making the beautiful art. I want you all to know that. Aww. So remember how I was crushing on Lois? Yes, I remember. She's been trending nonstop with people crushing. Oh my god. <laughs> I saw some Lois tweets earlier on Twitter when I was looking through the drama and the chaos. Honest to god, I'm happy a lot of people love her. She has such, such a cute design. Lois Lane, oh my god, Serenity, Serenity crushing too. Monster went boom, Monster went kaboom. Oh god, fuck off, rats. You're not nice like President Rat, so I don't like you. To find a way through. No 
get pissed off. Don't get pissed off at me, please. Okay. We got this. We got this. Just take it slow. Take it slow, Sina. Take it slow. Take it. Fuck my life. There's a fucking thing blocking my way. Fuck my life. I'm a true believer in tomboy supremacy. Okay, I've got to tell you guys something funny. I actually was indeed a tomboy when I was younger. Like, very much so a tomboy. I hated skirts. I hated frills and everything. And then I grew up, and I actually came to really like skirts and frills. But I still also love my tomboy clothes. So, like... I believe in tomboy pr supremacy, and I believe in cute girly supremacy. I think both are amazing. And I feel like people can embrace both. Ain't that always the way? See, it's always been the way for me because I've always been a rough and tumble person. So, like, when I was younger... When I was younger, it just never... I never wanted to be super girly or anything because I didn't see the appeal in it, at least not to myself. I saw the appeal once I got older, of course, because like, oh, I like this. But like, when I was younger, I didn't see the appeal or the reason why girls wore like frills and pink and everything. That's explosive. Oh, I know what they want me to do. Smart game. Smart game. And then we hide under here. Look at it. Don't look at it. Look at it. Why am I breaking my own rule? Don't look at it. Oh my god. Teehees. Teehees and gay. Same, honestly. Teehee. Most tomboys do, cuz me too. Don't turn around. Oh. He's gone. He's gone. Oh. Ain't that always the way? <laughs> Tomboy is a personality, not a way of dressing. Honestly, that probably explains a lot of shit with me. I'm probably still a very tomboyish at heart, honestly. Personality-wise, tomboyish. Dressing-wise, tomboyish, comfortable, and also cutesy and girly. I like. I also uh, occasionally draw, dress like, like punk rock, emo, like scene kid still, because that was once upon a time a phase in me. A phase, yet the style of clothing... I have never disliked. What are you doing messing with that? Come here. You can't mess with that. That has my medicine in it. You can't mess with that fuzz. I know it. I haven't put it up yet because I'm lazy. But you can't mess with my medicine, cat. I just got these refilled today. It wasn't until 12th grade to now is why I liked having perfume and putting on more jewelry. See, I don't care for, like, jewelry or perfume. I just like frilly skirts and cute dresses and adorable uh, hoodies and stuff. Like, I like cutesy, girly things. Like, I like that stuff. But I'm not one for, like, jewelry and everything. It's, like, why Senna's design doesn't have, like, a bunch of jewelry and stuff. I like accessories, though. I love accessories, like the little frilly gloves and the little garter and, of course, the apron and the hair bows and ribbons. I like that stuff, but I'm not really much of a jewelry person. Just not really my thing. Uh, I'm almost surprised I wasn't as girly, though, because I had all the girly stuff when I was tiny. She isn't a girly girl herself, but still surprised her. Now, that's kind of funny. So, hi, Space Ghost Bones. It's nice to see you. It's nice to see you. I see you peeking. I see you peeping and peeking. 
So if it would be too difficult, don't think anything of it, but next time would it be possible to have a darker uh, chat uh, color chat box? I can have a darker color chat box. I can do that. I can work with that. I've been trying I've been make, I've been mixing and matching with the uh, colors and stuff anyway, so like I understand. It's hard to make it match my aesthetic and still pop and stuff. But I'm going to make it work. I'm going to find a way to make this work cuz I uh think I have a way to make the chat box like darker and stuff and like uh make it pop more cuz I it is important you guys can see chat. It looked like you smacked your lip when you said don't turn around. <laughs> I also want to cutesify my room in the future. I want to make it a prime aesthetic room. Honestly, same. My room, honestly, is just a room that's just, I don't know, it's just full of a belongings, but it's not really decorated. I want, like, to decorate my room, make it aesthetic. I want, like, those super cute fucking gamer setups, too. Well, I have a super cool gamer setup. I want to also make it cute. I make it cute and cool as fuck. I like frilly stuff that's... Why I like made so much little I do like made costumes and stuff way more than I thought I did before. Originally I wasn't gonna be a made VTuber. Uh I wasn't gonna even be like anything made themed, but then it kinda just fit with me. It kinda just fit and I, I like frills and stuff. You know what? It just goes with it. And I like it. Hi Timmy, big brains. He's always a he's always a joicy. How are you, Timmy? How's your day been? Only for this game when it's pretty much entirely black. <laughs> This game is meant to be pitch dark. It's so dark. And while your eyes do adjust to darkness in the game, it's still hard to, like, see. Cute is expensive. Pink tax sucks. I don't even want pink. I want oranges and yellows. It's been good. How has yours been? My day's been interesting. It hasn't been bad, but it's definitely been an interesting day. Uh, if uh, you, you probably would have an idea if you looked at my Twitter. It's been an interesting day. It's not like a bad day, but it's not a good day either. It's just been a day, I guess, if that makes sense. But it's, I'm happy streaming, though. This is like lightening my mood a whole lot. Fair. Yeah. And... Yeah. Here we go. Don't you start shit with me. Ooh, I'm like right here. Ooh. That's a hole. That's a hole. And I don't like it. This is locked. That's explosive. Okay, I see what you're doing. I see what you're playing with here. Okay, I see what the game's giving me. I see what the game's giving me. I see what you're giving me. Don't 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 I will piss on you. I probably shouldn't say that. You at you you accepted the Dakimaru and spared me. I don't wanna know what other weird things you want from me. I see what's in my inventory. I can take this. Take the flare. Okay, we have this, and open that. Bullets! Hey, that makes it for the bullet I used earlier. Dazzle. I thought I was walking around. I thought that motherfucker was walking around. Uh, that's good. It helps with the mood. It always helps with the mood. I'll say this right now. Streaming, honestly, is so fun. It's so good for me. I, I admit, I'm a person who sadly doesn't have a life that allows her to, like, go out very often. I have a very sedentary 
introverted life. Not that, not that I'm not an introvert. I am indeed an introvert. I like a lot of my time alone. But, like, when I do want companionship and stuff, I don't often get a lot of opportunities for it. Uh, so streaming very much gives me a lot of that opportunity, and I'm very happy for it. I get to connect with more people, and it definitely gives me that social interaction I'm happy to have. Oh, this is not open. Are you serious? You better to screw me over like this for, for real game. Ooh, grenade. Obviously blowing this up ain't gonna work because it would have worked from the other side. Uh, bullshit. I have to go back the other way. Well, I guess if we're doing that, then... Do I want to use a bullet or do I want to use a grenade? I'm gonna use a bullet. God, you'll do what now? <laughs> That's way too far for me. I'm not that degen. <laughs> we all know now where Mr. G draws the line. He he'll he'll take a Daki Maru. He'll take the mommy voice. He'll even make a joke about a riding crop. But he don't he don't like them golden showers. <laughs> oh my god, it's too funny. Hmm. Yeah, I've chosen not to deal with Twitter for a bit because of the mess. I don't usually get involved in VTuber drama to me, Big Brains, and I won't go through the whole rehash because I did talk for, like, 30 minutes at the beginning of stream about it. But, like, uh, I'm going to give you, like, the TLDR. TLDR, that situation does bother me to an extent because I am a person of color. I am a POC person. I am multiracial. I have a black father and a white mother. And, like, uh, you know, uh, it's that whole thing of, like, I am a person, and the racism in that whole situation was bothering me, so I did make a tweet about it, which I usually don't do. I usually keep my Twitter squeaky clean and everything, because I don't like the drama. I just don't. But, uh, I did, like, like give my two cents on the situation, though, because it was, it did piss me off. It hit a certain nerve for me. And I was just, I tried to be respectful to everybody and understand everybody as much as I can. I get that as a PSC also. Thank you. And again, I'm not saying like the VTuber from the concert deserves hate. Nobody deserves hate, honestly. Not Kenji and not that VTuber. It's a whole thing where I think culture differences, like culture humor is clashing here. And I think there are people who wanted to defend the VTuber but took it way too far by encouraging racism in the slurs. That was just too far. So, honestly, for me, that's just my biggest pet peeve with it. But I gave my two cents, and that's the end of it. And you know what? I'm content with that. That's a whole fuck holes, whole suck. <laughs> I love you, Nautico. <laughs> that's explosive, fuck explosive, they suck. Whoa. <laughs> I low-key wish you were... Uh, maybe, maybe in the future, if I have, like, a super calm just chatting or a... Uh, or a... Uh, art stream because i did used to do art streams fun fact i did used to do art streams might do an art stream in the future maybe for chill nights but uh if i ever just do it but maybe on some just chatty streams or some art streams not a cool, i can pull you maybe stark or claire or whoever is in chat in and we can have a whole we could have a whole talk like we did earlier because that was so much fucking fun Joke, right? That was a joke. Mm, we all know it wasn't a joke, but we also know you were making a joke about something that wasn't a joke, so don't you worry. We know who you are, Mr. G. <laughs> you bet your ass I'll join immediately. Fuck yeah. Hell yeah. Wait, can he open that door? You know what? I'm not going to look to find out. I'm not going to look to find out if he can open that door. <laughs> ara ara <clears throat> Let me get a sip of something to drink real quick And then I'll do it <clears throat> I 
Ah, da, da. <laughs> that one wasn't the best I could do. I could do better. Mm -mm. Ah, da, da. There you go. <laughs> Serenity, <laughs> that Evo. <laughs> e a pretty fucking good donut. Donuts actually sound good right now. Honest to God. But you know what sounds better than donuts? Cinnabon cinnamon rolls. He's crip crawling all around, the bastard. Hello? Wait, I can't take any more. Mm, drop the shit. I want fuel. Oh, there's grenades galore in here. Oh my god. I'm gonna come back and rob this entire fucking place. I'm gonna come back and rob this whole place of, of resources. Move. I can't climb over if you're in my fucking way. Oh wait, no, I can actually... Oh, you're gonna let... You're just gonna lean it there, but I can't use it like a little bridge. You suck. There you go. Eat a pretty fucking good donut. Sin of dead. I love that sin of dead emote. I love that Stark used that for the Fugi react. Is it Fugi? I forget what the thing's fucking called, but I love it. Nanako, that honestly is one of my favorite emotes. I love it so fucking much. Love it so fucking much. Oh my god. I haven't had Cinnabon in a grip. In a grip. I'm. Is he out? Wait a minute. Is he out? Is he out right now? I think he's out. I think he's out. He's out. I think he's out and about. Last time I got left on. <gasps> it's about to run out. Oh, I'm about to run out of time. He went away. I need to get back. 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 Just take it calm. Take it slow. Send it. Take it calm. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Take it calm. Take it slow. Oh. My God. I can't see shit. I can't see shit. I can't see shit. I can't see shit. I can't see nothing. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh. I adjusted my screen. I actually see what's going on now. <laughs> uh, the game has to be dark, so it's difficult. So keep in mind, I'm just as blind as you guys and all this shit. I got honey buns. They are not cinnamon rolls, but they are good. Honey buns are good. Honey buns are good. I'm still dying how it looked like you were drunk out uh and dead on the counter and then I joined it looked like I was menacingly looming over a dead body. Nanako just uh murdered me confirmed on Stark stream 100%. BTW for those of you who don't already follow Stark, you should follow Stark. Stark's amazing. I always hang out at Stark's ch uh chat and shit because Stark is an absolute joy. And I absolutely adore Stark and Stark's been doing lots of art. She's working on, uh, 
She's working on art fight stuff. She's working on commission. She's even working on a commission from me. So like, literally go support Stark. Stark is amazing and has wonderful art. I'm literally so proud of it that I'm going to open emote comms as soon as I have a set of reference emotes to show. Do it! Nanako, you have great emotes. Honest to God, so great. Honest to God, do it. I support. I will show you out. I will shout you out 100%. I don't even care if I have to go back on Twitter and deal with its bullshit. I'll shout you out and show you out. I did it before and I'll do it again. Because as soon as you made me that send a dead emote, I shouted out your Instagram on Twitter. Because I wanted people to be like, look, look at this amazing person who made me art. Go support them. I'll do it again. Just give me a link and I will show you the hell out everywhere. Twitter, threads, YouTube, you name it. I'll, make, I'll do it. I'll do it. I got your back. Ah. Oh, thank you. I'm going to make emotes for my friend in when they're able to add emotes. Oh, I see it. Of course. You tell me. Give me a link. Give me a link to anything, and I will shout you the hell out. I got your back. Don't you worry. I got your back. I'm going to make sure everybody sees shit. And if I feel like they haven't seen your shit enough, I'm going to, like, show up on their front door and be like, Look at my friend. Look at her art. Look at my friend's art. How could you have not noticed her amazing art yet? Look at it. Why well, do I get the feeling they're eventually going to take the safety of this room away from me? I get the distinct feeling they're going to eventually take the safety of this room away from me. Which would be weird to do since it's a save room, but I get the same feeling they'll do it eventually. Is that all the gasoline I had? It was. Let's see. I do need this. Uh, I need to go open up the arsenal again. Open that, and then we're gonna open this. Hello, fellow sour cream and onion enjoyer! I freaking love sour cream and onion chips. Let it be known that that is like my favorite kind of chips. If you want to win me over, give me like sour cream and onion chips. And I don't, I don't, that's, that's like one of the few chips I really, really love. And honestly, I eat them without like, you know, any dip or anything. They're just perfect as they are to me. So how are we going to do this? Where am I going to hide? Because once this shit goes down, I need a place to hide. I need to get the map. But I have nowhere to hide if shit goes south. Oh, wait, nope, this might work. This might work. You know what? Fuck it, we ball. We're either about to learn a really important life lesson today, children, or we are about to, uh... Be as smart as can be. This is about to be big brain, or it's about to be horrible. Speaking of, did you buy them yet? Little, I have to wait for the thing to transfer to my account first. I don't want to spend them any money until I got the money already transferred. Gotta be smart with your monies. Gotta be smart with your stuff. I wait till it transferred over until I start spending anything. Because if I spend it now when I don't have the money, it's not going to work out for me. Uh, I see. Yeah, yeah. You gotta be a responsible adult with money. Top tier. Top tier indeed. Hot Cheetos or spicy chips in general for me. Don't don't come over here. Please, dude. I promise you a Dakimaru. I promise you a Dakimaru. <laughs> oh. I promised you a body pillow with a sexy anime girl. Don't be 
this way, I promised you a sexy body pillow, even if it's a bit egotistical, cause it's just me. I promised you a body pillow, please. Would you go away if I promised lingerie? I love you. <laughs> I don't know. Save it. Save it. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for following. You are now a sweet roll. Okay. The promise of a lingerie body pillow. I think bought me extra time. Or is he gone? I can't tell if he's gone or not. He might not be gone. I can't tell. Hi, hi, happy to be here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Happy to have new people here. Responsible? What's that? Does it taste good? <laughs> it tastes like impatience. That's what it tastes like. I think I can move. Okay. Yes, I needed this. What the hell? It's just a floating bottle. Don't do that to me. Stop it. Stop making noise. So this storage area C, I need to get over there? Uh, I can't get over there because I don't have anything to open the, the thing with. I have nothing to open that with, so I can't get over there. There is more stuff in deeper into this arsenal area that I want to go get. I need to go get it right now, because some of it is fuel, and fuel is precious. It is like the equivalent of lifeblood. <gasps> That's where the hole is! Don't mind me, I'm leaving. I'm gonna leave you in your hole, B. I'm so sorry I bothered you in uh, your hole. Damn, the rats just be dead over here. Dude, what am I doing? I can go this way. I can just go this way. The promise, the promise of a lingerie body pillow. Now I gotta think of lingerie. That one I'm not going to leave up to you guys. That one is me and my decision, and I get to decide what sexy undies I wear. That is all for me. You all think this is for you? Hell no. That's for me. That's all for me. Let's see. Bandages. Fine. Bandages. Make grenade bullets. Reload. Anything else here? Nope, not as far as I can tell. Oh, there's this meat. To be honest, I don't know how useful that's gonna be for me. But we got some extra things. We're gonna go help go back. So we should be able to do that. Go back. I'm gonna examine that map a bit more. I'm gonna examine that map from earlier a little bit more. Cause that needs to that needs some more thorough examination. Don't go that way. There's a tripwire. Don't don't go that way. There's a tripwire. So we're gonna go through here. Now where the hell do I actually need to go though? Hmm. I 
wonder. Okay, so I was gonna so I could take a look at it without like So we're obviously right here. Storage unit blah blah yeah, this is where we were. Explosive storage, supply closet. So it is back here behind this thing. But how do we get to that? Oh hello, a picture. Is it something where I have to blow the door up, or is it something where I have to get bolt cutters? Because it's 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 uh, connected via a chain, and I don't know if the chain is going to be something realistic, like use an explosive and blow it up, or if it's going to be oh thank you for hydrate Nanako, or if it's going to be something along the lines of use a grenade. Ah, thank you for the hydrate. I need it. Well, I guess we're gonna test the theory right now. I guess we're about to test the theory, ladies, gentlemen, and everybody in between. We're gonna see uh, hydrate of di hydrate of diorite. <laughs> we're gonna test this and see exactly how this works. Oh wait, these are. These are gas grenades. Wait a minute, this still works in my favor. Oh. Requires a detonator. This fuel too. Okay, so I have an idea of what I need to do. I have an idea. I have an idea. I have no grenade, but I know where some grenades are. Hydrate or diorate? I know, Nanako. I read it. Diorate. I have an idea about where I need to go exactly. Also, grab these. These will also help immensely. These will also help immensely. I know what I'm going to do. Damn this dark hallway. Damn this dark ass hallway. But it's not really any el anybody else's fault but my own. Damn this dark ass hallway, but it's not anybody else's fault but my own. Be gone, rats. Oh yeah, that's right, this hurts me too! You know what? We're okay. We can, we can live with a little bit of blood. Okay. I heard this room. We checked out this room. Grenade! Another one of these. Uh, I can drop the flares if need be. They're not the end of the world. Okay, I need to look around here. That's a grenade. Nothing in here. I've been here. I've been here before. And the big thing about this is that. Uh, what was the big thing? Oh yeah, okay. Hiding space. Hide behind chair. <gasps> Please. Please. I am chair. I am not real, I am chair. I am not real, I'm sure. I think you might be able to die in this game. I, 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 I'm invincible. Nothing can hurt me. If I keep seeing that, I will manifest it into reality. I am invincible. Nothing can hurt me. If I keep saying it, I'll manifest it into uh, reality. Mama, ooh, if 
I sing it, it'll be real. If I sing it, it'll manifest. If I sing it, it'll be real. I'm invincible. I can never be hurt. I am an immortal being that will never be harmed. Well, that's half right. That's actually half true. All things considered, that's half true when it comes to my lore. Also, I got an achievement for burning a body, but I didn't burn a body. Oh my god. Oh! Jesus Christ, that's terrifying. Oh, hello! Drop you! I want that. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. What this? Nothing here. That does not open. Uh, I have no healings. Phew! Wait, oh, it's fuse? No, that's just rags. I'll come back for you if I find another set of rags. Hello. Nasty rats. They're heathens. The only good rat is President Rat. I don't even know if I'm supposed to be over here. I'm just going over here because it seems like I'm supposed to... Because it feels like I need to go this way. Damn, this place is in fucking shambles. And it's dark. Goddamn rats. Stop being assholes. Oh, that didn't hit at all. Well, I mean, it hit, but it's not killing them. There's some things in there. Possible goodies. Let's see. Workshop. Oh, hell no. I'm hating it here. Come on. Clear out noxious fumes and gas. I need to check. Come on. Hurry up. They were eating cheese! Ooh, rags. I needed you. And there's an explosive barrel over here. Oh, and that's it. No, you assholes! Fucking asshole rats. Fucking ass rats. Them and their fucking love of cheese! Ass rats, ass rats, ass rats. Mama ooh just killed a man, put a gun against his head. Now he's dead. That's a song. I don't know. I can't remember what the fucking song's called, but that's a song. I'm in some sort of mood, not a normal one. What about Remy from Ratatouille? Remy is okay. I changed my mind. Remy from Ratatouille is okay.
what is that note? Note to a dead friend. I promise you a Christian burial, but you must understand the rats would not stop coming. They swarmed your body, their teeth, their claws. They would not stop. I did what our ancestors did when faced with unclean things. Burnt them and burnt what was left of you to stop them from coming. If you've made it to heaven, please forgive me. Uh, buh, buh, buh. I remain down here in hell with that demon. It will come for me soon. I know it. I'm going to do as you suggested before. You died. Make a pillbox. Please, if you're up there, watch out for me. A pillbox? What the fuck's a pillbox? What's a pillbox? I have no clue. I am not uh, educated on what that is. Oh. You died in your bed. I am so sorry. That looked like a very painful demise. Can I please look around? There's nothing else really in here. Is that wait a minute, is that a Molotov? Wait, 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 wait. Bottle with a cloth. A bottle with a strip of cloth can be thrown. Oh, empty bottle with cloth. So is that like a Molotov? Holy shit. Bohemian Raz. Ah. What should I name the bee? Barry. Barry the bee. I like that too. No, I'm not going the bee movie mystery. Oh my god. Wait, no. That was the bee movie bee? For real? I was just thinking Barry the bee because it sounds cute. Read him the script for the bee movie. I'm not going for the bee movie. I didn't even know that was a thing. I mean, I know about the bee movie, but I didn't know, like, Barry was the bee's name. You fucking heathen ass rats. There, I can finally see. There's something there. Oh, it's just cloth. Go away. Heathen rats. Oh, this is gonna fucking hurt. What was that? Is that a key? Oh no, that's scissors. I'm gonna get under the table for a minute. How much time I got left? Not a lot of time. How about Kisa? Kisha? She's a bee-based VTube. Ooh, I didn't know that. Sure, go ahead. Name your bee whatever you want to name it. Not feel pressured to name a bee a certain way. Is it your bee? Name your bee like that, Kisa or Bob. B. Oh my god, Bob B. You're giving me King of the Hill flashbacks. You motherfuckers. Heep. <laughs> Blow up lots of rats with a single grenade. That's the achievement I just got. Oh, he out and about. Bobby was suggested by a motherfucker in my friend group. He slay though. <laughs> Wait, no, is he running around or is he- Oh no, he's out. 
I looked to my side and everything went blurry. Oh. He's beside me. Is he staring from the darkness or something? He's not running around. You bitches. Oh God, fuck you, I'll use another grenade. Why not? <gasps> Don't look. See nothing but the floor, Sina. Nothing but the floor. The, f the wall. You see nothing but the wall. You see nothing but the wall. It's a beautiful wall. I think I'm a go. <laughs> you see nothing but the wall. And he's gone again. Thank God. Oh, hey, a dog tag. Ew, it's pulsating. I got a bunch of name tags. That's pretty good. Fuel storage. Considering how much time I got left, I'm gonna go straight for that. Come to mommy! You've got to be kidding me! Oh wait, nope! Yes! Use an empty bottle of fuel tank to fill the bottle with fuel! This is perfect! Well, it's it's somewhat great if I can figure out how the fuck to get back. So then my friend who suggested Bob B is because he watched the King of the Hill clip I'm dead. <laughs> Literally that's why I thought of Bob B. Gonna head to bed now, but enjoy the rest of your night. Thanks for the stream. Thank you, Corey, for hanging out. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Good night, Corey. Oh my god, I'm still frowning, my bad. <laughs> but good night, Corey. By the way, guys, did you know Corey has a YouTube channel? You should check out Corey's YouTube channel. Just saying. You should check out Corey's YouTube channel. Just saying. <laughs> uh, I had to shout my girl out. You know how it is. I got to shout out the homies. Did you know Cinna writes amazing stuff? Did you know Corey is an absolute joy? You know Cinna is literally so cool. Did you know Corey... It has a degree in, uh, what was it? English? Has an English degree? It's amazing. Oh, and I'm dead. You know what? I did kind of waste You know what? I can live with that. <laughs> I can live with that. Please, please. You're amazing. I'm amazing. Oh my god, that scared me. I know, right? It actually spooked me. I'm like, oh, fuck. You have a good rest, Corey. You have a good night. That was hilarious, though. That was terrifyingly hilarious. Did you know both of these girlies are queens? Yes, Nanako. Let's see. Okay, let's go and do this again. Take two. That goes to the tunnels. 
I need to go, I think, to either prison or maintenance. I was getting somewhere in maintenance. So I'm going to head back to maintenance, because I think that's where I need to go. Back to maintenance. So is that you? I'll take care of them. I'll find grenades in there. I can use the grenades to my advantage. Uh, let the snow, the not the snoke, snoke. <laughs> but thank you so much. You have a good night too. You have a good night too. You have a good night. A good rest. And thank you for hanging out. I always appreciate it. Okay, that clears out these assholes. That clears out the ass rats. Yes. Speed this along with the poison gas, please. Come on. Speed along. Speed along. Uh, I wish this would hurry up. Also, is there a way to burn bodies just regularly? If that's the case, I should figure that- Wait, no, wait. The empty bottle with the cloth. Oh, wait, no. It makes sense now. It makes sense now. Wait, is it telling me to do Molotov cocktails to get rid of the dead bodies? Is that what I'm supposed to be doing? And is that quieter than a grenade? Oh my god, I'm stupid. Why did it take me till now to realize that that was an option? I could have been making life ten times easier for myself. And I run back. Table. Become a chair. Become chair. But I could have been making this ten thousand times easier on myself if I if I just realized I could have been literally throwing Molotov cocktails. Wait, but if I can do that, how do I burn them then still? Because just throwing a bottle with a cloth in it isn't going to set it on fire. Yeah, there you are. You took a, a hot fucking minute coming out of your hole. I'll figure it out, and if I don't figure it out, well, it sucks to be me. I'll figure it out eventually. And if I don't figure it out, well, it sucks to be me. Uh... Why does he not eat the dead rat bodies? He's been eating people. Or maybe he just kills people, I can't tell. There have been a lot of dead bodies left around that the rats have been eating on. So maybe he doesn't eat people. Maybe he just kills. I wonder why he only kills and not eat. Does he not need to eat? I wonder if that's the thing. If he doesn't need to eat or anything. cloth in there. I didn't get hurt this time, so I don't need that cloth. This is gonna lead up here to the Molotov. Uh, up to a dead friend. And where, where is our wine? Axe Noyer. 
Okay. Fear and paranoia. Not if. Blah, 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 blah. And I have those two. Uh, carry any more items? Drop a grenade. Because I really need to figure out if this is going to work the way I think it's going to work. got absolutely mulched in your bed, you poor bastard. Yeah, that's not gonna do anything. So what's... How do I light it then? I named the Bikisa and then put them under a slab to keep her in my room. Damn, Nanako, you trapped Kisha the bee. You trapped Kisha the bee. But how does this work? How am I gonna light this thing then? Eh. Well, I tried. I tried. You don't ever went down this way. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to piss you off. Oh, hello, you guys suck. I know that I just picked up. It can hear me. Every time I take a step, I swear it can hear me. I've crawled into this hole here. I'll just... Oh, no way. I'll just hold my breath and maybe it'll go away if I'm quiet enough. Oh, God, let me be quiet. Uh, You were quiet enough. Pro the problem wasn't that you weren't quiet, hun. It The problem was that... Well, I have no other way to put this. Uh, the problem wasn't that you weren't quiet. The problem was... You were in it. Oh. Not in a fun way. Wait, is he coming out? Ooh, is he coming around? Coming out? The rats got scared off. That's time I got. Not enough time to be fucking round. I don't have to just fucking book it back and put fuel in. I really cannot afford to waste time. I'm just gonna have to go. I'm just gonna have to go. I'm just gonna have to go. Oh, you hookers. You know what? Fuck you. Why didn't it blow up? Wait a minute, why didn't it blow up? Why didn't it blow up? Are you- Oh. So now you blow up, huh? Now you fucking blow up. Fuck you too, game. Fuck you too. Hookers. <laughs> Part of me is I'm particularly salty about two people in the Minecraft server, even though they're thousands of blocks away. Kiss them my bee and I will not let certain people harbor. Oh my god. Oh, there went the power. Now 
if since I know his shit, if I can run around more in the dark without so much of a problem. Hmm. Actually, maybe I should try that. Maybe I should try, instead of letting the lights be on, I try running around a little bit in the dark. I mean, it's going to be difficult, but I've kind of got the decency, I kind of got the decent idea of the layout. Maybe I will try that. Actually, let me try that. Yes, load the last save. Okay, how much time I got? I got half a thing here. No wonder I didn't fucking last that long. I gotta hear my cat sell to me, like, let me in! Let me in! She can come in later. At least cat hair isn't much of an issue. Good. Okay, you know what's funny? Cat. Despite them having no fur, Sphinx cats are not hypoallergenic. That's actually something to keep in mind. Despite having no fur, uh, Sphinx cats are not hypoallergenic. What the hell did you just. <laughs> you clipped the rats not getting blown up. That's funny. You hookers are so lucky that I only have, like, gas grenades. All the way to when you went back and it did blow up. Oh my god. I love that. Thank you, Nanako. It's gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt. It's okay. Just a little bit of blood. We, we can live. It's just a little bit of blood. Take this off. Run back. I never closed the door there. I probably should. He's gonna come out. Chair, protect me. And there you go. I'm kind of getting the hang of this more. Uh, I meant cat hair getting on my clothes and stuff. Ah. I was just giving like an example because I was like, fun cat fact of the day. Sphinx cats are not hyperallergenic. <sighs> Cause that is actually a true thing. Sphinx cats are not hypoallergenic. Oh god. Next time I we I save, I might end it for the night because I am feeling tired. Working out damn has working out today actually drained a lot of energy for me. Eep yeah. But again, that's because I I worked out earlier today. I also did Instead of resting a whole lot, I did get on Stark stream, too. So I also was very social. So very social plus workout and no eep equals epicina. And I don't usually do uh, We got four clips at least. <laughs> Eepy-eeps. Maybe. I, I'm not fully solidified. Maybe. Let's see on the back of this one. This dude up here has, like, stuff and shit. Uh, I'm also gonna drop the bandages up here and come back for them. I really just want this gasoline. Open that. That's a grenade. That's the note. These photos are pretty cool, but I, I want to look at them at a different time. When I'm not in mortal terror. <laughs> I 
I do, once again, feel sorry for this dude right here. He thought if he hid in the hole in the wall, he'd be safe. Hand. Hand. He stuck his hand out. E.B. Creepy, he stuck his hand out. Started. Come aside. Close the door. Get under the table. Chair protects me. There we go. Eepy creepy. Eepy peepy creepy. Sleepy eepies. Uh, sheepies. Yeah, that made sense. That made complete sense. Tippy-toe. You know, I ran all the way back here. I could have just gone up and hid in the closet upstairs. I'm really fucking dumb. I really could have just hid in the closet. I'm a special kind of stupid. Is he not running around? He's in the ceiling. So I think we're okay. How much time we got? Okay. Let's walk for a little bit. You're okay, man. Walk it off. You're a soldier. Still one fucking rat left. But that's better than a bunch of rats. I can get by you. I'm not bothering you, eat your food. Oh, <laughs> Fuck. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Yep! 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 There's no praying, Nanako. Good night! <laughs> well... Don't pray if you're an atheist. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> that shit was funny. Good night. <laughs> I didn't even want to wait for the jump scare. I was just like, good night. <laughs> I didn't even want to see the jump scare. I'm just like, good night. Goodbye. So long. Uh, <sighs> you're right now. Honestly. That's just what happened to me. Honest to God, that's just what happened to me. So, that's too fucking funny. Uh, but thank you guys so much for hanging out. I'm gonna call it a night because I am extra EP Because of so many things I've done today. Uh, thank you guys. You already know who I'm gonna, who I'm gonna raid. I mean, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty much a given. 
you you all know who I'm going to raid. You all know who I'm going to support. You all know who I'm going to go hang out in the chat of. Yeah, uh, thank you guys for hanging out. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. It always makes my day. Here is your raid message, my dudes. Thank you for the stream. Thank you guys for hanging out. There's raid message with my emotes and one with the universal emotes. <sighs> Sorry the stream is so short tonight. I I I'm just extra EP because I did so much today. It's starting a new workout routine on top of everything takes the energy out of you. Like damn. Uh, I don't think I have any big announcements this week, really. Yeah, no really big announcements or anything. Thank you guys for hanging out. I really appreciate it. You have a good night. Behave in Stark Stream. I will be watching. But yeah, bye-bye. Goodbye.